Hi, welcome to my Facebook page. This is uh, Sichamba Jacob. All right, so we've got this question right here where we've been asked to find the determinant of uh, matrix P. So if you're able to see nicely, matrix P is a three by three matrix. So now how do we tell that we are dealing with uh, a three by three matrix? You count the number of rows. So how many rows do we have? There are one, two, three. What about columns? One, two, three. So it's three rows by three columns. So it's a three by three matrix. Now, how do we get to find the determinant of this matrix? Let me just give you an example of a two by two matrix. I know most of you know how to find the determinant of a two by two matrix. So let's say you've got M, matrix M, which is equal to A, B, C, and a D there. So if I say find the determinant of this matrix, of course you're going to write M and the bars there is equal to, okay? You multiply the major diagonal. That is A times D, it's A, D, minus C times B, which is C, B. Like that. So this is how you get to find uh, the determinant of a two by two matrix. Let's try to put in numbers. We put in numbers and see how the answer will look like, okay? Or how the determinant will look like. So let's say this is M, the same matrix M. It's equal to, we've got uh, a three, two, four, a five there. And they say find the determinant. Of course, we're going to say uh, M or determinant of M is equal to 3 times 2, it's a 6, minus 4 times a 5, which is a 20. So the next thing here will just be to simplify here, we're getting a negative 14. So this entails us that uh, the determinant of uh, this matrix is negative 14. Now, let's try to jump on what we're supposed to do, which is a, a three by three. All right, so upon getting that information, the information that we've gotten on how to find a two by two matrix, we can apply it on this. So we're going to say determinant of matrix P, for determinant, we put it inside water, the bars, will be equal to, now look at this. We come to this number right here, it's a one, write it down and then open bracket, close. So what are we supposed to put inside here? There will be a zero here, a one, a two, and a one. Now, how have I gotten these numbers? If you're able to see, one is right here, this one, okay? So don't get what is in line with one. So you can see these numbers are in line with one, don't get them, there. and these also are in line with one. So just get these which are not in line with one. Let me do this so that maybe you understand. You see, the numbers that I'm blocking, don't get them. Get these which are remaining. Because these numbers are in line with the one, the one which is right here. So the next thing here will be on this one. So whichever number is right here at the midpoint between these two, which is here, change the sign. So look at that. It is a a three, positive three, so write negative three. If it was negative three, I would have written positive three. So you open and uh, close. So when picking the numbers to put inside here, you use the same concept, like this. These are the numbers we get, two, four, one, one. So let me write, two, four, one, and a one, like that. So these are the numbers we're getting. The next thing, will be to just get what follows, which is a, a seven. And then inside the brackets there, we put what? Eh? Guess, try to guess on this one, if you're following. Okay, I guess your guessing is two, four, zero, and a two. Okay, because seven is right here. So we are not getting what is uh, in line with seven. We're getting what is not in line with seven, like that. So that's a, uh, that's the first step that you need to know when finding the determinant of a three by three matrix. So the next thing will be now 
to start finding the determinants inside here. Okay, so the determinant of this two by two, so it will be zero times one, which is zero, which is equal to a zero minus two times one, it will give us a two. So these are inside the brackets, and there's a one in front here. This one, okay. We say minus three open bracket two times one, it's a two minus a four, like that. Four times one is just a four. We say plus seven there okay so we shall say two times two it's a four minus a zero because four times a zero it will just give us a zero okay so we now simplify here when we simplify we are getting a negative two minus three open bracket here it will be a negative two because when we say two minus four it's a minus two then we say plus a seven there, a four right here. Okay, so now from this stage, if you are following nicely, this would definitely give us what a six, because positive, uh, negative, and negative will give us a positive. Three by two, it's a six, and then here plus a twenty-eight. Seven times four, it's a twenty-eight, which is equal to uh, a four plus. 28 because negative 2 plus 6 it's a uh, it's positive 4 so when we add these two we are getting a 32 so the determinant over uh, this 3 by 3 matrix is uh, a 30 32 so that's it hopefully you've benefited you've learned one or two things please remember to share the video okay remember to share this video let me just write the determinant here so that we get to understand it. So the determinant here is a 30, 32. Thank you so much. This has been Sichamba Jacob. Bye-bye.